One of the first city officials to be updated when something like this happens. Uh, thank you for joining us, Mayor Adler. What have you been told so far? What details do you know? Well, at this point, obviously, uh, of, of highest concern, uh, we have uh, uh, real good folks working on this right now. Uh, they have all the resources that they need. Uh, we're going to find uh, who's responsible uh, for this. Uh, the details that I think you have been reporting uh, is what I've been heard. Uh, two people, uh, both without, uh, with, with non-life-threatening injuries. Uh, and uh, the, the important thing for everyone to, to, to keep remembering is if you see a suspicious package uh, of any kind, don't, don't touch it. Uh, call 911. If there's any doubt in your mind, call 911 and let let somebody else make the decision as to whether or not it's truly suspicious or not. Mm -hmm. When when did you get the call about uh, what happened tonight? And then what message uh, again do you have for this this entire city right now? Well, the, the, the council was informed uh, right after the uh, the incident uh, occurred, uh, and the message uh, the, the message for the city is is one they should know that that austin's one of the safest cities in the country we continue to be that way obviously uh this the, these incidents are, are are incredibly uh troubling and and it's the highest priority right now that a lot of resources are being put against it uh the federal teams are engaged uh, we're going to find who's responsible for this and we're going to stop it uh, but the, the most important message for, for everyone is if you see a suspicious package, don't touch it. Call 911 uh, and, let, and let somebody else make that call. And Mayor Adler, a lot of families have been out of town this past week. We're coming off of spring break. A lot of kids will be back in cl the classroom tomorrow. Is the city working with the local school district at all uh, to get the message out or, or just ensure safety uh, across the city and in all of our classrooms? Yes, the city is working with school districts to make sure that uh, everyone knows, uh, well aware of the fact that uh, folks are just coming back from, from uh, vacations. That was one of the reasons why the police chief uh, held the press conference that he had today, so that uh, the media and stations like yours would uh, 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 reaffirm and, and, and remind everyone uh, if they've been gone for this week uh, what happened and to tell everybody don't touch any suspic suspicious packages. Mm -hmm. Tell everyone to call 911. Have you have you been told any details about tonight's explosion? Whether or not uh, investigators at this point believe it was another package? Uh, you know, at, at this point, I think you need to get all the the details from uh, from from Austin police, uh, and the, uh, best you get the information from them. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Um, with so, with so many calls coming in, uh, Police Chief Brian Manley uh, just reported today 700 calls over the last few days of suspicious packages. Um, you know, how is how is APD able to to respond to these calls? Uh, the the type of manpower out there. What are you doing in conjunction with the police department to make sure that there are enough people, you know, out there on the street to properly respond? Everybody should know that we have the resources to properly respond. Uh, there are uh, 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 over 100 people that are actively working on this alone. Uh, there are actually 300 people across the country that are working on this. Uh, people shouldn't be worried at all about calling 911. Uh, area uh, uh, agencies, the state, have offered additional support if we need it. Uh, so we have the resources to be able to confidently say to everyone, if you see a uh, if you see a suspicious package, don't touch it. Call nine one one. That's the message that we have for the community. Hey, I gotta go. Uh, uh, thanks for covering this, and thanks for telling everybody. Mayor Adler, thank you so much for your time tonight. We sure do appreciate it.